look, rather than being prosecuted, Mr. Penny should be given an award, public service award for bravery. Um, you know, what he did was essentially defense of himself, self-defense and defense of others, which you are entirely entitled to do, even in New York City. This was a violent, deranged man who is making direct threats to numerous passengers on that subway. He took the only action anyone could who is capable of taking that action. He stopped him. He didn't know when to release the chokehold on him. He didn't know that if he released that chokehold, the man wouldn't have reached into his pocket, grabbed the knife and stabbed him. He had no idea. So he did what was reasonably expected of someone in his, in his position when someone made violent threats of death against other passengers. And you know something, you would think, Dan, that the prosecutors, even guys like the prosecutor, the DA uh, in New York City would have learned something from the Kyle Rittenhouse case, where he was he was uh, basically excoriated by the media for taking defense uh, against the attackers in that particular case in Wisconsin, and yet he was acquitted. Look, look, the same thing's gonna happen here. I don't care where it is, New York City, wherever it is. This man took reasonable action in, in self-defense, defense of others, and no jury is going to convict him. I hope you're right, David. I'm not going to hold my breath on this one because it's a different jury pool in New York than it is in Wisconsin.